JSON stands for JavaScript Object Notation. It is a lightweight format for storing and transporting data. A JSON file has this form. Data is in name value pairs. A name value pair consists of a field name, in double quotes, followed by a colon, followed by a value. Data is separated by commas. Curly braces hold objects. Square brackets hold arrays. In this example, the array contains four objects. Each object is a record. In this video we create an application with App Inventor 2, and we show how to load a JSON file from the internet. This file is converted to a list. Then we extract the values and display them. First, create an interface that contains a button, a label, and a web component. Then, go to the blocks part. Start by creating a variable. Then program the upload button. To load the JSON file, we need its URL. Now run the HTTP GET request using the URL property and get the response. The JSON text decode block decodes the given JSON encoded value to produce a corresponding App Inventor value. A JSON list, X, Y, Z, decodes into a list, X, Y, Z. A JSON object with key A and value B, B is decoded into a list AB. We finish by displaying the result in the label. At the end of January 2017, App Inventor adds show lists as JSON in the properties of Screen 1. This property presents lists in JSON format. Now we want to show each record separately. To do this add two labels and a button to the interface. Create a variable n initialized to 0. n represents the number of the record. Each time the following button is clicked, the value of n is increased and the corresponding record is displayed. If we reach the end of the recordings, then we return to the first record. Look up in pairs block used for looking up information in a list. This operation takes three inputs, a key, a list pairs, and a not found result. Lookup in pairs block finds the first pair in the list whose first element is the key, and returns the second element.